Hello, welcome to Board Games with Niravas. Today it's time again for Terraforming Mars, and uh, this is the number eight in the series. So we are uh, getting uh, sort of close to the end. Uh, I'm really going to miss this once we're done, but as I said earlier, I think I will do some variant as well with the expansion once it comes out. And um, before we get started, I'm just gonna ask you. Um, to, if you are not a subscriber to the channel, then please click the red button down there and subscribe. Uh, you support me, you show me that uh, there's uh, an interest out there for my channel. But also for your sake, you get uh, notices from YouTube when I post new videos. And um, make sure you click the little bell there as well down there so you can get the notifications. If you already are a, a subscriber, which I hope you are, then um, I will ask you today to go and check out this little link here, which goes to my vlog from um, the beginning of this month. Uh, check it out, and uh, maybe you can find some entertainment in my um, uh, rambling all about board games, but also there's some information in there that are quite interesting, I think, for you guys uh, regarding games and, and so on. And what's to come and all that stuff. So, anyway, let's get to the game, and we already we have the cards out here, all set up, and um, well, Draco is ready, so I guess we just do the setup as usual. Uh, so let's first of all um, do these uh, placements, so we have number 12. So we go a city over here, and the greenery goes 12, and that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, so that's... Uh, one, what did I say? Twelve, so that's one and seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, yeah, it's over here. And then we have it down here, we have number seven, so that's four, it's over there, and the greenery goes to eight, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So they are sort of out of the way, um, although it's always nice if you can use the greenery for points, of course, but we'll see how that ends up. Then we'll do the uh, five corporations that are left. Let's see which we get now. So Mining Guild. And Helion. Uh, I like I like Helion. Um, so let's see how they fit together with my ten cards. Uh, I pulled out ten cards. I just sorted them in number order or in cost order. So we have CEO's favorite project. This is nice if I get something to put uh, resource cubes on. Uh, okay, so virus. This is worthless in a solo game. It's just for attacking your opponents. Mine goes. Let's see. If we do mining guild, then they get. When I get steel or titanium as a placement bonus on the map, I increase my steel production. And I start with steel production and steel, so if I do them, then I don't think the mine really is worth it, because I'll have so much steel anyway. Well, on the other hand, I can pay for this with steel, so okay. Uh, ice cap melting, I think I will hold on to that one, but it's kind of late game though. Power supply consortium, requires two power tags to increase energy production once I've increased my own one step. Two power tags though, that's not a beginning card. Magne magnetic field dome. Increase my energy production too, so that increased plant and raise terraform. It's quite nice. But let's just look, I mean, there's a lot of building tags here. And I don't think, let's see, if, I don't think, there's not really any heat stuff in here. I'll, I'll think I will save Helion for later, because that depends on heat, is when you can use heat as money. I'll save it, and I'll go for mining guild now. I'll do it, because you have the building tags there and everything. Uh, not that they don't, really, they don't really matter in the solo game, I think, but anyway. So, this one, uh, I'm not going to pay three to get it, because I have no idea when I get a resource, a card that can hold resources. This one is too late game to start with, I think. Mm, this one as well, two power tags. Um, I'll hold on to this one, though. Uh, when any city tiles place gain two credits, I mean, it's going to cost me like 11 in total. And so I have to play place like six cities. It's not going to happen. I don't think so. Uh, insects are nice though. If I get some plant tags, so I could do that one. 
together with Noctis farming, which gives me a plant tag. Yeah, this could work. And Martian rails. Um, spend energy to gain money for the city on the Mars. Once again, this is not really good in a solo game, I think. So it wasn't that good of a card draw, actually, but I'll take four cards. So I'll start with 30 bucks, but I will be paying 12, right? So start with 18 instead. And I'll uh, get also get five steel. And I'll get a steel production as well to start off with, so that's nice. And now I will try to put out as many tiles, so tiles are more worth now. If, I, if there's a card that lets me put out a tile, no matter what it is, basically, then I can put it on steel or titanium, and that raises my steel production as well. Alright, so let's get started. That was it for the first generation, and I think we're ready to start. And so, um, let's do it. So I have I have 18 and some steel. I'll play the mine, uh, which takes two steel for four. So I'll get another steel production right away. Just get that going. And this one requires me to lower energy, which I don't have. So this one requires six percent oxygen. This one requires me to raise the temperature a bit before I can use it. So all these three cards are not really usable right now. Uh, but they could be good later on So maybe I should for my first 18. I think actually I, I'm just gonna go straight out and buy me myself uh, ocean tile So I'll start that way because in the end most of the time you have to buy oceans anyway, uh, you're not really going to uh, Find cards to put up all nine and I'll put it down here where I'll get two titanium which might come in handy and that means my steel production goes up uh, as well, so that's good starting off three and uh, my, it, Of course it raises my TR which I don't have any right now. So I'll go from 14 to 15 and So I got some TR going for and I got some steel production. So let's just hope I get a lot of buildings during the play Okay, so let's go to production and we do as we always do um, I'll do move this first because I don't want to forget it. I should move it after I get production, but never mind And so I'll get my 15 once you start doing something like that, then just stick to it if you have a habit. I mean, it doesn't really affect anything, but it helps you out so you don't start doing things in another order because then you're going downhill. Okay, so I'll get three steel and that's it. And so I'll get four new cards. Okay, Mars University. Hmm, when I play a science tag, I can discard a card to draw a card. It's not bad, but the thing is I'm trying to keep low on card here anyway. Uh, Earth Catapult could be nice. I'll get two discount for any card, which means it cost me 26 So I'll have to play 13 cards after this one to make it count I'll do that. I think I will play that, but I don't know if I want to pay that this much I can't even pay it right now, which means I will hold on to it play it later And then it's not then I won't perhaps I won't do 13 cards after it. So Security fleet, it's just a point card. Well, I'll just go for the asteroid then. Uh, <laughs> if I see an asteroid, I'm like, yeah, I'll take it. So, um, I don't even have to think about that. And the good thing is, now I actually have some titanium also because of my ocean placement, so I can't play this right away. Because I don't think I can do anything else, really. Uh, no, I can't. So, uh, let's play the asteroid. I'll pay six in uh, titanium, eight in cash. So that's 14 and I'll get two titanium back which means I'll, I, I got my titanium back that I, I used and I'll get one temperature raise which is the most important thing right now. Just get that T up or up a bit and start working on the goals. So we'll go over there and I'll get the TR and I have four bucks. I don't think I can do anything with this. So let's just go to number three, right? So I'll get my 16 now. Slowly going upwards, and I'll get three steel. So I might be, I might end up in a situation where I'm overproducing steel because uh, if I can't find uses for it. But rather to do that, I mean, it's, it's kind of easy for me to get steel production now. So maybe the mine was a bad choice, even though it only cost me seven. Uh, I don't know. Um, yeah. Okay, so I'll get four new cards. 
And Livestock, it's an, a sort of endgame card and it's you get money production and points, not really interesting. Quantum Extractor, this is kind of nice because it lowers my cost, uh, well, oh, yeah, lowers my my cost to space base tag cards and I usually do that a lot, like the event cards and such. Um, I'll also get a lot of energy, but I need four science tags before I can play this one. I would like to have it later on though, but I don't have any science tags right now. I like this card, I do. Uh, search for life, well, yeah, I know, some of you guys don't think I should get this in a solo game. <laughs> I know, but I, I like it, but I'm not gonna get it again. I, I got it uh, in an earlier run, should just, I think it was number five or six, just for the fun of it, but let's, let's avoid that. Uh, mangrove, I do like, I had this before as well, put a greenery on an area of search for ocean. But it's an endgame card, plus four. I can't spend money now on cards that I won't be using until later, well really later. So I don't know if I'm going to get any of these, perhaps the quantum extractor. But then again, there's a, that's the problem again, there's only 14 generations. If before I get four science tags, they might be, you know, four or five generations away and then when I play this, the this count isn't gonna work, so let's just skip the card for now. Hope for better ones, and um, yeah. So now I don't think I can play any card. Nope. <laughs> so what do I do instead? Well, I think. Uh, I think. I mean, it's it's down to standard products, of course. I think I'll go for. Uh, I'm not going for another ocean. I think I'll go for the um, raising temperature for fourteen. Um, because um, I want to get to the heat and so on, and I'll get to TR, but it's not looking really good so far. Uh, but I've been really lucky with my card draws the, the last few games, so I mean, it evens out, and of course, uh, right now I'm not feeling that lucky. But okay, let's go to the production, go into number four. Uh, did I do that right? Four, six, eight, ten, eleven, three, six, nine. 10. Yeah, it's a correct. Okay, so let's get the production of 17. Um, 17 credits, or mega credits, even for me. Um, okay, and then we get three steel, so that's starting to look really nice. I hope I get some really expensive uh, building later on that I can pay for with steel. And that was it. I don't have anything else, so let's take a look at the new cards. Energy saving, uh, increase energy production for each city tile in play. You know, this one is good in a multiplayer game where there's a lot of cities. I mean, if we do it right now, I would get two because of those dummy cities. But two energy races for 18. Well, maybe it's not that bad idea. I want to get this one out. Um, that was, I don't know. It was a bit cheaper, maybe. Uh, way power. This one I do like because I will probably buy some oceans pretty soon anyway. Uh, great escapement and consortium. Uh, okay, I can. S yeah, if I have steel production, I can increase my own. I don't need steel production anymore. Um, if I need it, I will get it once I start placing stuff out here on the production. Yeah. And increase for each earth tag I have. I get more credit production. Not really an interesting card either because earth tags are quite. I don't know. So no good cards really. Oh. Well, I mean, to be honest, I have to use, I have to work with what I have. I can't just skip the cards all the time. I think I'll go for wave power at least, because then I can get some energy going once I get some more oceans. Uh, I have to get some cards at least. So now I have four cards, but I can't play any of them yet. So I have 20 credits. And uh, a lot of steel <laughs> that I can, can't do anything with. Um, I think I will. I mean, if I reach temperature enough, I could go for this. Not just farming. Mm. Yeah. So it's either that or getting more oceans. You know what? I'm going to pay uh, eighteen for an ocean, and I'm going to do it so I can put an ocean. I'll get a TR as well. That's so why I can put an ocean here to get two more cards because I really need to find some good cards now. I'm getting a bit panicked here. I look at that. I, it's so it's this. It's like this every time I play. I mean, you guys that have been following this series, you know it. 
because I chose mine angle, now I get all the steel production stuff. When I did Ecoline, I got all these plants. It's so crazy. <laughs> I've been shuffling for like 20 minutes before I start the video. Uh, then again, I can't pay for this with steel, so I think I'll get it. It also gives me an energy production. Yeah. Optimal error breaking, I do like this one. Uh, it's not that expensive, and I mean, this one really pays itself quite quick. It cost me 10. Uh, if I play four space events, then I made 12, so I'll, and I'll, I'll make the heat as well. I need to get the heat going. So, um, well, I did get these two cards. Uh, I'm not going to buy them, so <laughs> I have them. So, uh, yeah, there we are. And the thing is, I can these cards I can actually play. They don't have any requirements that I have to sit around and wait for. So maybe what they weren't that bad. Um, but there's better cards, of course, in this situation. Uh, by the way, I can play. I can play them both right away. Yeah, let's do that. Um, so optimal error breaking cost me seven. I'll pay six in titanium and one credit, and we have it out and going. And then uh, of course industrial micros cost twelve, which I'll pay six steel for. That gives me steel production, and it gives me an energy production. So that's kind of good. I got some use for the steel, which is really important to have. So it doesn't just sit there and, and, and laugh at me. Um, yeah. And now I'm getting close to this one as well. The next turn I might put out another ocean. So, so that was it. Uh, not too bad at all, I think. Something's happening at least. So um, let's get to the production then, I guess. And we'll do... Um, I'll move this one, and we'll get uh, 18. So um, I think I'm moving. I'm. I'm uh, it's going way too slow. I think uh, just getting one TR every round is not going to work out. Uh, four steel. Uh, I'll just take one of these, and then one energy. And the new cards. Let's hope for something good here. I want something I can pay for with steel, basically. Um, local heat trapping, I can get some plants, but I have to spend heat, which is not going to happen. Um, sponsors, yeah. I'll pay nine. After five rounds, I made the money back. Uh, but I will play nine more rounds, so... I think I'll take that one. It's an earth tag, might work for something. Uh, this one I do like. It gives me heat, and remember, uh, space. Space event, that's what I'm looking for because of my optimal error breaking down here, so I'll get that money back and so on. Uh, toll station doesn't work, I don't have any opponents. So, uh, two coach for six, and I'll guess, let's see, I have 13 left, so there's no ocean coming this generation. Uh, so I'll guess I'll do, let's see, can I do both? No, I can't. Hmm. Which one is most Yeah, I can, because if I play this, I get money back. Yeah, so I'll play Import of Advanced GG first. It cost me nine. Um, and I'll get two heat production, which is really nice. Uh, but it also, I'll get three heat and three uh, credits back from it of that effect so that means I do have six credits to buy this one as well so I'll get two uh, credit production so not too bad uh, and I'm already starting to use my optimal air braking which is really is sweet so then we go to run generation six and I'll get income of 18 plus two so I'll get 20 now I'll get four Oh, this is going to sound terrible when I'm trying to find the cubes for uh, steel. And this one goes over, of course, and I'll get a new energy. And I'll also get two more heat. So that's starting to stack up there. So, uh, yeah, okay. New coach come my way. And that is Arctic Algae. When I place an ocean tile, I gain two plants. I will place seven more oceans. If everything goes as planned. So that will be 14 plants, which is almost two greeneries for 15. 
And I agree, yeah, that's kind of yeah, that's kind of good price. I, I think it's quite interesting. Okay, here we go with building tags. Building industries decrease energy, increase my steel production. No, thank you, because I already have so much steel production. Uh, really. Um, <laughs> Soil factory is more interesting because I'll decrease energy production to increase plant production. That's more interesting. Colonized training camp is just points and it's, uh, yeah, so no points cards at this stage. And sabotage. Oh, it's the other. There's like two really just evil cards in, in, the, in the whole game. Virus, which I had at the beginning, and this one, sabotage. The, the only thing they do is damage someone else. You don't get anything. For so it's pointless in, in a solo game. So should I get one or two cards? I don't really feel like lowering my energy production, I only have one. And it will cost me, well I can pay for it with steel, that's why I'm thinking about it. I'll take it, I'll take it, I, I'm kind of low on cards as well, so... Okay, um, so I have this effect cards, but I need to actually, I need to get some production going. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, not good, not good, not good. Um, so, I'm, uh, once again, I can't play any card, really. Um, I mean, I could play this one, I guess. Um, I would need to raise temperature a bit. This might be a big loss, I don't know. <laughs> Starting to look like that. Let's play a uh, Soil Factory at least for 9, I'll pay. And I'm going to overpay actually, so I'm going to pay 10 in steel, save the money. Uh, I'll lower my energy, I'll get one plant production, yeah. So that's that. Then I have 15, so I'm going to raise temperature once. Oh, and I'll get heat at least, I'll get one heat production going. I'll get a TR. So I don't know about you guys, but I'm not really feeling it this time around. Uh, we're already we're heading into generation number seven and not much have happened at all well that's how it is uh we'll see i'll do my best to try and do this so um production time in the end of the sixth round and we get 19 plus 2 so that's 21 and let's see four 21 there we go four steel um, one plant and three energy, not energy, heat, sorry. Uh, so I can, hello, hello, I can raise the temperature, that's what I was going to say. Okay, I'll take, let's take a look at the new cards. Um, yeah, well, knock the city that I can pay for with steel. Might be a good choice. Uh, protected habitats. Well, once again, I get one of these multiplayer cards. I mean, these should almost be removed before you play solo because it's just, yeah, it's pointless cards. Um, so boring. And I get points with pets. Ah, uh, insulation, decrease heat production, and increase emmy production. No way I'm going to do that. So <laughs> I'm stuck with Noctis. I'm gonna get it. Yeah, I mean, I can pay for it with steel. So, in I, I get. I mean, it feels like I'm only paying three for it, really, because the steel is sitting there anyway. So, I mean, I might use well use it for something. So yeah, okay. Now I have to. I mean, now there's some heavy thinking here. I mean, it's getting, you know, time is ticking. Uh, something has to happen. But, yeah. Uh, I don't have any, any productions, I can't even play it right now, but there's no hurry playing Noctis. Well, it gives me income, but. Mm, well, let's just start with 8 heat. Um, that can't go wrong, right? So I'll get one. Temperature raise and one TR and you know what I'm going to do this. I'm going to pay 14 again I'm just paying here for the It's not good. I'll get another heat production Another TR and now it's 20 degrees. I can at least play uh, What's it called? Noctis farming um, Which I'll 
P ten or P five uh, steel. And I'll get an income raising credits and I'll get two plants. I'd rather have plant production, but yeah. Um yeah, okay. So that was that. Five more coins. Can't really play anything. I have I haven't touched the oxygen so far in the whole game. Yeah. Okay, I, I can't do anything more. I mean, it sucks, but that's how it is. So let's go into number eight. I'll get the production, which is 24 now at least. So if we can just get the car that I can really use, um, I'll be happy. I mean, I don't really have an engine even. Um, so four steel, uh, one plant and for uh, heat. So that's so far everything and I will just take the new coach. So pay 8 heat to increase your form rating one step. This one is really nice if, I mean this is the card you want if you get a lot of heat and you get to the top of temperature then you won't you know get any TR from raising temperature anything anymore but you can use this one instead. It's, it's totally pointless for me right now. Uh, hackers increase energy. It, this is not good for me either. Giant space mirror is good though. That one is actually really good. Um, and algae is quite good as well. But then again, I need three more oceans. I mean, in this in this uh, tempo, um, that's going to take me like five generations or something. It does give me plant production. So it's sort of giant space mirror is a given, I think. Uh, I'll have to take that one. I'll have to play it also to get. I'm going to skip this one because I'm. I, it's, I have. I'm just gonna take one card. I have to adapt to the the surroundings, which are quite hot right now. Um, so we'll have to do it like that. Now. Now I wish I had some titanium, of course. Um, but I need to get production, so I guess I'll pay 17, which sounds so much right now, um, <laughs> to get the giant space mirror, which means I'll get three energy production. And do I want to lower two of them to get T one TR and get the plants production? I'm not even sure if I'm going to do that. Uh, I would like to get an uh, ocean out and play this one. I need some oxygen. Uh, this one is not... Yeah. Not the city doesn't do really anything right now, so... Well, it does. It, it does increase my money. I think I should play it now, actually. So do I want free money production, or do I want... Plant and TR. I'm gonna go for Noctis. Um, cost 18, so I'll pay 9 steel. Um, yeah. And so I'll lower my energy production by 1, I'll get 3, so I'll get, I'll to, I'll get some money at least now. And I'll put out the actual city as well. And I'll do get 2 plants here. So. A bit closer there to making my first greenery and get some oxygen effect going. That is going so slow. Way too slow. Um, and I really don't feel like I can do much to speed it up. Um, I mean, I played Giant Space Mirrors just to get that energy going. If I play other cards to lower it, well, I mean... If I don't play this one now... If I play it, uh, I won't have any energy production again. If I play, if I don't play it, then I don't get any tea or this generation, and I don't get enough plants to put out the greener next one. So uh, I don't know. Maybe I'm, um, um, yeah. Okay, I'll do this. Four steel, uh, four in steel, one credit. Magnetic field dome is down. We'll lose that energy production. I'll get one plant production, and I'll get one tr. 
Oh, okay. Here we go. You see now I get two plants, so yeah. Okay, so production time, we go to number nine. Six to go, one, two, three, four, five, yeah. Um, so that is 22, 28 cash. And four steel, of course. Uh, two plants. Uh, no energy, but four heat. So this round I can both get the greenery out and raise the temperature. So that's that's sort of good anyway. Uh, but it's it's a, it's a generation of a nine. Okay, uh, robotic workforce. This is a really nice card if you have some good. Let's see if you have some good production thing you can copy. Well, this one I guess. Three energy. Uh, production is not bad. Uh, I think, yeah. Yeah, I think that's the one I will go for if I take it. And then, I mean, uh, the, um, the giant space mirror cost me 17 plus three. This one costs me nine plus three, so it's cheaper as well. Um, this one I would like though, uh, because I can place a tile, which means I can get my steel production up. I'll also get to draw more cards. But it cost me 13, it cost me 15 for the first card. Red suits, uh, no, I don't think so. Immigration shuttles, mm. so expensive. So, two cards that I'm considering. Let's see, a restricted area would let me get one, two, three, four, five, six more extra cards. It also cost me, of course, if I draw bad cards, then, I mean, it's a gamble. Mm. No, I'm just gonna go for robotic workforce. I'm re being really uh, careful now on which how I spend money, because I have to pay so much money for standard products since nothing else is really happening. I sound so negative. <laughs> Sorry, but that's just how I feel right now. Uh, okay, so this is no hurry with getting. Although I could get it out and then get... I want to get it out before I do insects because then I want to plant tag, right? But I mean, that's a long way to go before I get there. So I think I would do a robotic workforce for nine. I will copy that uh, then space mirror, which means I'll get three energy again. And then I have 24 left. Hmm. I mean, if I want to get an ocean, then it's bad to get an ocean and not have this one out, right? But I can't afford an ocean and this one, so... Perhaps I should uh, actually get a greenery. Uh, it's quite expensive, but I don't know what to do. I mean, I'm, I'm panicking here. So let's get a greenery for 23. Um... You might think I'm crazy, but I don't know what to do. I mean, I'm not really, it's not working out. So, um, oh, by the way, I should mark the city, of course. Uh, so let's, uh, let's put it here. I'll get two plants back uh, from that. And I'll, um, yeah, I'll get the oxygen up, which increases my TR. And then I'll spend the eight plants. To do another one, and it goes here, and the same thing happens again. Two plants in return, and oxygen and TR. I'll spend a heat to uh, raise temperature, which raises my TR. So something is happening, but it's going too slow, I think. Yeah, so that was it. Um, let's go. To the next generation. I hope I'm not forgetting. I'm not forgetting something important, but I don't think so. Um, if I do, tell me in the comments, of course. Tell me any strategy tips and so on as well. And um, if you see any errors, just uh, put in the time stamps to where it was, because then I can put the subtitle in on the Klingon channel. So you should turn that on if you haven't. So let's go to the tenth generation. I'll get 25. I get 31. Uh, cash, I'll get four, um, steel, 
and let's see, two plants, and this one goes over, I'll get three energy. Um, I was so pumped to do this one, but then the, it, it just doesn't work out for me, I feel. So that's, that's how it can be. Uh, it's the luck of the draw and so on. So let's get new cards. So four new cards and we have nuclear power. So this one is actually nice. I can pay for it with steel. I'll get a lot of energy and I do uh, just lower my income. So let's do that. Mass converter, um, it's too late for it basically to get the discount and I need five science tags so Advanced ecosystems, it's just a points card uh, I get every point card in the game it seems a Lightning harvest requires three science tags <sighs> Yeah, okay, just nuclear power then um, So, um, plus me three of course and uh, I'll buy it right away and I will be using steel. So that's 10, so that's 5 steel. I'm actually getting some uses for the steel. Uh, so two, lower 2 in credit production, but up 3 in energy production. Okay, and I can't do a... I can't do uh, either of these yet. Uh, this one requires 3 oceans. Now I don't feel so rushed about getting any production anymore. This one requires 6% oxygen, that would take a while. This one could be nice to do though. I actually have one credit to for you to do this. Because if I do, if I pay 18 to get an ocean out, I need 12 for this one. That would be nice because then I get two plants and I can do a greenery. Okay, so let's do this. Let's sell this one because it's just one in energy production. I mean, it's so stupid to buy it for three and sell it for one, but yeah, that's how it goes. Um, so, so then I have 12, which means I'll play Actic Algae, or however it's pronounced. Um, and then I'll put out an ocean tile for 18, which means I'll get two plants, so I can put out the greenery also. But first of all, let's do the ocean, and the ocean, well, I can get even more plants, of course. I need cards, I need cards desperately, so let's get the good card. Well, I got Begin from Thorium Asteroid, so expensive, but it's really good. This one you want to copy with the, with the robotic workforce. If you play this one first and you play, play, play this one for nine, you could copy the whole box. <laughs> That's like a dream come true, but okay. So it requires Joe and Tag, which I don't have either. I don't even know if I'm going to get one. Most Joe and Tag cards are quite expensive. So I'll, yeah, but I mean, I got it for free, so I'll just hold on to it for now. Maybe I'll sell that one later on. Let's do eight plants for a greenery. And um, I am somewhat limited, of course. Did I raise uh, TR for my ocean? I think I did. But I was not, yeah, I was on 25, so. Um, so greenery time. Uh, I don't care about the points right now, so I'll just put it over here because then I'll get a titanium and a plant. So, um, it would be smarter to put it here, of course, for the, the points, but who knows? I don't think I'm gonna make it anyway. Uh, oxygen and TR. Uh, at least I got a titanium, which could help me to get some other card out later on. Because I'm kind of poor, <laughs> and it's, we are sort of almost done. Uh, not really, because there's a lot happening in the last generations, but... Okay, let's uh, take a look at how I can solve this puzzle. So, I have 27 plus 4, so that's 31 in credit income. Uh, one, one, two, three, yeah, so we're in, in uh, the 11th uh, generation, and 4 steel comes my way, 2 plants. These move over, and I'll get... 6 new energy, and I'll also get 4 new uh, heat, so that's, that's, yeah, that's starting to work out, but uh, maybe uh, too little too late. Here's new cards, and of course I get uh, animal points card, yeah, why, what a surprise. Uh, <laughs> capital, uh, it's kind of nice, actually. Um, 
it's 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 a nice one. If I get another ocean out, I could play it. Put it next to some oceans. Uh, I mean, I get five, but it's kind of expensive as well. I could pay for some with steel, of course. Artificial photosynthesis, increased plant production, more stuff, or energy too. Hmm. Farming. This one is nice, but it's really late game. Plus four temperature. I mean, by that time, I don't know if it will do that much good. Mm, should I get this one to get my plant production up? That would cost me 15. That would generate four plants. <laughs> That's a half a greenery, so that would mean the greenery would cost me 30, so 23 is lower actually. Capital I can pay for with steel. So I'm even, I'm almost more attempt, attempting to get this one, but then again, I uh, only 13 steel. I don't have that, so I'm not gonna take any cards. So they're just bad cards. But I mean, this is so. I mean, this is kind of bad for the players. I mean, one of the last game I got like perfect cards, and now I get like the opposite. Why couldn't I just get balanced instead? <laughs> okay, so here we go, guys. I have. I have, if I had a Jovian Tiger, I wouldn't even go for this one, just for all that, but I can't play it right now. Um, okay, so I have 31. Uh, okay, let's start with raising some temperature for 8. Heat. And TR. I think by this time I usually, I usually should appear somewhere on the TR. Um... 31, what's most important at this stage? Well, everything is, is important. That's the problem. <laughs> There's not one thing that is that stands out. I'll just do, I'll do an ocean uh, for 18. So I'll get two back from that, but I'll also get two plants. And I can put the ocean in such a way that I get two more plants, which is nice. I'll get a TR, of course, as well. Uh, let's put the ocean over here. I'll probably put some greeners here, then I will get some cash there as well. So, two more um, plants. I have seven plants. Too bad, I don't have eight. I have 13 bucks, so I can't really do anything with that. Hmm. I'm so stuck. I'm so stuck. Uh, you know, you know, in some, you know, I don't want to give up, but I feel like it's it's over. But I'm going to play it out and I hope you will watch. Maybe there's some <laughs> something happening that could save me. At least a bit. I would at least like to be close, you know. Okay, so production time for it before the 12th generation. I get 29 plus 4, so I get 33 bucks, which is really low at this stage. Uh, I have to say that. Uh, I'm gonna stop whining. It's no fun listening to me whining. Um, and then I'll get 4 here. Two plants. Oh, I can do a greenery. And I'll get this move over. I'll get uh, six energy. And I'll get four heat. I'm almost at the point I can do a double temperature raise. And let's get some good cards. Let's be positive. Come on. Yay. Here comes the good cards with energy production, which is really nice. But I don't know. I could pay for it with steel, and yeah, I think I'll hold on to that. Ooh, here we go. Two oceans. It takes. It has to be zero degrees, though. Uh, are you also noticing I'm not getting the space events for some reason now? <laughs> I did the optimal air braking to get me. Uh, solar wind power. Increase energy pressure. I was thinking two titanium. Yeah. It cost me 11 and the uh, three I have uh, titanium power plant. Uh, I'm not gonna get that one, not the normal power plant, but I think I will get geothermal power because, yeah, and I think I will go for lake mariners as well, but I will skip solar wind power actually. So I'll pay six, which means I have 40 bucks, and let's see what I can do. 
okay well this one is a given so i'll pay it in steel 11 i'll pay um yeah five plus one credit um i don't want to overpay right now i mean one credit i can spare and so i'll get two energy production so that's up to eight if i only have something to do with the energy except just waiting for it to become heat uh, I would like to play this one, but I need some more oxygen before I can do that. But I do have two plant tags, so yeah. And this one requires zero degrees, and this one requires a Jovian tag, so the cards are not looking good. But let's do a greenery um, for eight plants. And let's see where to put it. Uh, of course, I will. I almost tempted to get over here, just get a card. I'm gonna do it. I'm desperate. I need cards. Uh, so there we go. There we go. I'll get a card and it's the perfect one or not. Oh, <laughs> mineral deposit. Fire steel. Well, I'll hold on to it. And if I get some big card that requires a lot of, you know, steel, then I can play this one to get the steel and then play that big card. So yeah. But it wasn't what I was looking for really. Mm, okay, so uh, pay eight heat for a temperature raise. That's a no brainer. And so another TR. Now I'm sort of, uh, I don't know, a third of the way or something. And I have a lot of money. So I'll just be, I mean, this is standard project uh, play, basically. Um, <laughs> I'm just doing standard projects all night, which sucks because I mean there's no way I can make it if I just do standard projects. Mm, okay, so let's think about it. What do I do then? I have 39. I do have some money. Uh, I don't want to steal right now. I can't play any of these cards. So cards are out. I'm down to standard projects and I want to sit here with a lot of money and not do anything of course. So I think first of all, um, let's use the card I have. So 18 uh, to get an ocean tile, which means I get two plants. Let's use that. Um, ocean, it was, I'll get a TR and I'll put the ocean here. Well, I get two more plants and two credits. So uh, I'm starting to build up my plants. Again, and uh, then hmm, then perhaps should I do another one? I think so, why not? So let's do uh, 18 again and that is another ocean and two more plants. This I will be able to put out another greener which is nice. Um, I'll do the same thing again basically, put it here, I'll get a TR, I'll get two plants for that, and I'll pay eight plants to put out the greenery, and let's just keep the wheel spinning, I'll put it here to get two more plants again, and the oxygen goes up and TR goes up, and two more plants back. So well, that's uh, the best I could do right now, I think. Um, I mean, paying 18 for every ocean, it's not fun. But what's my options? And I mean, I did get this card, which means I, so, I mean, need to have two oceans left once I get up there. So I guess I'll buy another ocean perhaps, and then I'll go just spend all my money on, on temperature. Um, yeah. Okay, so that was it. Let's go to the production and we go into the 13th, which, you know, as you can all figure out, we're almost done. So 34 plus 4, that's 38. Let's do 40. I'll get 4, in, uh, four steel, um, 2 plants. This goes over there. I'll get 8, uh, 8 energy. So my energy and my heat is good. I mean, not maybe. Yeah, it, I mean it's okay uh, for this for this uh, scenario. Uh, being in the the 13th generation, it's looking good. But the other ones are slacking a bit. So 
Uh, okay, and I'll get new cards. And I really need something now. Titanium mine. Well, it's a bit late for production, to be honest. Then again, I mean, I can pay for it with steel. Ironworks. This is the one I should have had from the start. If I had to put the cards in a different order there. <laughs> no, I mean, it's been for any Yeah, I have to get that one. Media Group is nice as well. Uh, it pays itself really fast because I'll get three back when I'll play something with an earth tag. No uh, event event card. Not that I had that many event cards this this uh, match. Investment loan. This is a given as well, I think, because I'll pay. So these one goes together actually. If I get this one, it costs me nine, and then when I get this one, it costs me six. But I get three back, so it costs me three. It costs me twelve to get these two cards basically. But I'm not going to be able to get that many more events. Of course, we're almost done. I'll just get this one as it is. I mean, it's still making me, it cost me six, it gives me four bucks in profit. And I'll get Ironworks, of course. Oh, I wish I had Ironworks earlier. As soon as I started getting my energy up, I should have had it. Okay, so that's six to pay. Um, and then, what do I do? I'll play Ironworks, of course, it costs me 11. I'll pay uh, it in 5 steel and 1 credit, I'll use it right away, spend 4 energy, get 1 steel and get the oxygen up 1 step. I'll play the investment loan as well, um, cost me 3, but that means I'll get 10 in return. I have to lower my income by one, the credit production. And so um, now I'm actually at six. It's not a good spot to play it, but I have to do what I can do. So I'll play in six for nine, uh, which means I'll get um, one plant production per plant tag. I have two plant tags, so that's why I'm saying it's not a good spot, but uh, I have to do everything I can. So I got two plant production. And that was it for now. Then we are down to 33 uh, credits, some steel and so on. I'll use, I'll do a double over here. So I'll pay 16 uh, heat to do a double temperature raise. That brings us up to minus 10, 2 TR of course. Yeah, so for now I'm, hmm. I need to get to zero degrees, so I can play that card and get two oceans out. So should I just raise temperature? Or should I get an ocean now to get two plants? I think I will do it like that. Uh, so I'll pay 18 um, to get an ocean out, which means I'll get two plants. And then I can... I'll get a TR. I can place it in a way that I get two more plants. Which means I have enough to uh, place out a uh, greenery for eight plants. And the greenery uh, just goes over here. I'll get one plant and two credits. And yeah. So the uh, oxygen goes up once again. I'll get a TR. I'm so already almost at that bonus thing there. Uh, I'll pay 14 uh, credits for a temperature raise, which brings my TR up again. I mean, I, I'm not going to make it. I can see that. But if I would, that would be kind of cool to make it with, with just basically standard projects. But of course, the game is designed so that won't work. So. Okay, let's go into the last round. Let's get this uh, over with, basically. So, I'll get production, which is 43. But, I mean, I will never give up. I will never quit in, in advance. I will always try to finish these solo playthroughs, of course, and try to make it with four plants. And these move over. I'll get eight heat. Actually, yeah, let's do that. So, 
I'll get four uh, heat. I'll get eight energy. I'll get four heat. I always say the wrong name on these two for some reason. Uh, so that's that. The last four cards are coming now, and now we get ants, which is not bad if you get it at the right time and so on. Um, I guess. Uh, industrial center. I don't want to spend money to increase my steel production. There's no real use in. I could get like, I could get two plants if I place this tile. Then I will be paying three. This I'll pay with steel, so I'll be paying three for two plants. I'll do that actually. <laughs> oh, aqua fire pumping, pumping. This is nice if you get it earlier. Now I only have two oceans left, so. Oh, this is nice because I paid with steel as well. I get these cards in the wrong order. Fuel generators, not bad at all, I guess. If you get it at the wrong time, right time, I mean, getting my energy up now, it's pointless. So let's just get industrial center for three. It's kind of crazy. I'm just doing this to be able to place that tile and get some plants and just desperately try to hang on. <laughs> and I'll pay uh, two, I'll start, I'll pay two steel to place it out. Uh, for four, which means I get to put this uh, this uh, tile out. The factory it has to be adjacent to a city, which is no problem because I can just place it down here. I'll get uh, two plants and four credits for that. So um, that wasn't that bad of a move because with those plants I have eight now. So now I'll do a greenery for eight. And it goes here, I'll get a plant back and I'll get four more credits. Every credit is valuable of course, even though it looks like we're already done. This goes up to TR because this goes up as well. So at least something is happening here in the, in the last uh, generation. I'll do Ironworks, which is paying four uh, energy. We get one steel and get to raise the oxygen. We'll pay eight heat to raise the temperature. Uh, I will pay, yeah, I will pay 28 to rate, raise temperature twice. Which lets me get an ocean out, which means I'll get three TR in total. And uh, of course now you're thinking, well now I only have one left, why do I kept the core that lets me put out two oceans? I know, I know. <laughs> but I mean, I'm getting affected by the how the game is going, I guess, so... Do I want one plant or four credits? As I'm putting out an ocean, I'll do get two plants, let's not forget that one. I hope I, have, uh, I haven't forgotten that. I don't think so. Um, I'll, need, I'll just go for the money now to see if I can do something with it. So I'll get four credits there, um, which means I have 27. I'll have three plants anyway. Yeah, 27. What can I do with 27? That will make some sort of a difference. Well, of course, I'll pay. Uh, I'll pay 18 for another ocean. So many standard projects, I've never done so many standard projects in one game, that's crazy. That means I'll get two uh, plants. And I'll put out the last ocean, and I'll just put it here to get two credits and one plant. And I have six plants, that won't help me at all. I have 11 bucks. This won't help me to get more steel. Um, this one won't help me anymore because I don't, yeah, the oceans. And this one I can't play because of, yeah, I don't need the production now anyway, so. Tell me if I could have done something differently to save this. I don't know. Maybe this is just one of those games where you, there's no way to do it. I don't know. I have 10 steel that I can't do anything with. I can't do anything with my money, so it's lost. I'm one, two, three, four steps away here. 
one, two, three, four, five steps away there. So uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sort of close, but I think I would need like two more generations or something to do it. Uh, which is, I don't have. So, <laughs> And of course in the end I will get four plants, which means I get enough plants to be able to put up one more greenery, but that greenery is just for points. I don't get any um, oxygen for that, not that it matters. So um, let's just put it there for the view. And that's it, we failed. Mining guild. I mean, mining guild isn't that good. I mean, this, I, I could get so much mine, uh, steel production with this one, but what should I do with it in a solo game? I don't know. Um, I mean, I need to get a lot of good building tag cards done to make it worth it. So, uh, yeah, that was it. I hope you enjoyed it anyway. Uh, we can't win them all, right? <laughs> so let's win the next one. Uh, tell me in the comments your best tips to win the next one. And thank you for watching. Please like the video. Uh, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great evening or morning or whatever you're watching this. Take care. Bye-bye.